right, ladies and gentlemen, we just got an emergency phone call that just came through. And let me tell you, who's up on the phone right now is none other than SWA, the man, Jerry Werner. We're going to get this stuff. Right we're going to get this stuff settled this right now. Situated so you boys and girls could have, you know, play nice, all right? Jerry, how you doing? Yeah, I'm just letting you know Octane's running his mouth about my guys, and he keeps running his mouth about me, and, and we're, about, bro, we're about to beat his ass, and he's not going to be able to show up at your event. We're just letting you know this ahead of time, because my... Yeah, this is Vinny. I, I, got, I, got my, uh, my, I got my bodyguard and Bobby Dream here, too, and uh, they're ready to take out Octane just at, at where he stands right now. Basically, basically, Mr. Warner, in a nutshell, is Octane has challenged Papa Canoosh, the big insurance policy, to a match, and he's they're looking to get it booked at Snow Brawl. No, I'm not. Octane is. He's running his mouth. He thinks, he, okay. he thinks he's Joey right, Warner. It's, uh, it's a little different than I think last week. Octane's right here, baby. Octane's right here. Octane's right here. So go ahead, Octane. Talk to the man. No, see, I had no problem. I wanted to take on Tough Jim Steele. I wanted him to be there. But all of a sudden, this big goof comes into my face and tells me he's going to beat the crap out of me. <coughs> so I'd rather just take out the biggest man they got. Because Bobby Dream's too afraid to get into the ring with me. Yeah, but you're saying if you beat him, you want five minutes in the ring with me? Who, who the hell are you to make that up? Who are you? Hey, you're afraid to get... All right. No, you, gonna, you think you're going to get five minutes in the ring with me? You smart boy. Shut Jerry. up! Jerry Warner has <laughs> to speak. Jerry, Jerry, Jerry go speak. ahead, man. Please, Mr. Warner. I'll take that deal, but I hey, he'll regret it too. Good at see. Well, yo, big goof, you got lucky that you don't get me one on one, but I'll take I'll take all you guys on hey, in the ring in the rumble. Last ride match at Angry Goomba Louie. Look oh, last here. ride, huh? Yeah. What? What are you gonna put me in a casket like that? Yeah, yeah, come on, come on, come on, you big goof. It'll be a blood brawl when uh, Papa Knoosh is done. I think there's going to be blood in the snow on March 23rd. Well, Jerry. <laughs> oh, yeah, well, definitely. Well, Jerry, I just want to say greetings and salutations. This is beautiful Bobby Dream, and I wanted to say that I am pleased and I thank you for my opportunity at Snowball and just like I said last week I will make the most of my opportunity oh, in the Snowball Jerry. Rumble. Okay, get off it. Whoa. <laughs> he went there. <laughs> okay, okay, okay Jerry, I love you too man. Have a good one for Octane. Big goof, big but, why, goof. but why is Octane running his mouth saying he wants to get five minutes in the ring of me if he goes through my uh, my, my insurance policy over here? Well, what's with that? Why is he running his mouth saying he wants five minutes in the ring of me? I'm not a fighter. I'm a, I'm a businessman. I'm a manager. I don't fight. I get people. I pay people to do that for me. Thank you. Hear that, Octane? You hear that? Yeah, you do, you, you, you benefit people outside the ring. So, uh, I really, uh, I can't see Octane versus Vinny the Greek. Thank you. Bravo. Shut down, buddy. How do you think? I just, I just have to say one thing. Wow, it's man. Long Island yeah. Independent Wrestling. Yes, it is. Vinny the Guido, who doesn't want five minutes in the ring with you? I think everybody in the uh, circuit And, and does, thank man. you, sir, for like backing me up on that. You see that? You're not getting five minutes of crap with me, buddy. Remember that. You know, Remember that, Octane. I don't Octane eliminated Papa Kadoosh and Bobby Dream and Tough Jim Steele and that's no ball. Then Octane would come to me and say, I want Vinny to Guido. Then Vinny would say, I want Vinny to Guido. 
No, no, no. Vinny the Greedo's not listening. No. Oh, no, 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 no. That is not going to happen. Mm -hmm. I am a manager and a businessman, and I'm a lover, too, with the ladies. I, I'm not a fighter. I, I'm, a, I'm a manager. Jerry, I don't Jerry, fight. Jerry, I, I don't Jerry, do that. Jerry, Jerry, do me a favor. I pay people. Love hey, don't bring up the dress on the air. What's Jerry. wrong with I do with boys, Jerry. What's wrong with that? Let me ask you a question real fast, please. So I think I can win this whole thing, but I want to be number one. What, does everybody know about no, the no, dress no. thing? Shut up. I want to be number one. <laughs> well, they see you every Friday night. I want to be entered number one. I want the big goof to be entered number two. Just so I have... We have our uh, hot seat. If you pay attention, we've already announced our number one entry. Our first entry for Snowball is Mr. Heavenly Hat Steve. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Okay. No problem. No problem. Yeah, getting shot down. Well, then do it. We sat down and we said, who on the roster is the perfect specimen? Who has the best cardio and physique on our entire roster? And you know what? Without a doubt, that's Heavenly Hat Steve. Okay, I agree with you. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You're right. <laughs> I just want to make sure I can get in the ring with this big goof. I just want to make sure I get a couple minutes with the big goof in the ring. I would just love to say that the co the lineup for SWA show coming up is great. And I, I implore everybody to go and see that because it's going to be one hell of a show, everybody. A He's pack. putting his nose hey. further, further up I hope there. you enjoy those little minutes in the ring with me. It'll be your last meal, Fungoolhead. Oh, Fungoolhead, huh? There you go. You heard it here. You got it. We're going to be honored to have you, Mr. Werner. We really are. And you all heard it. All right, just never mention me in the dress again, as long as that we're good. What, not mention? I don't even think about you in the dress. I need to sleep through Bobby Dream loves when Vinny's in a dress. All right, Mr. Werner, you have a good night. You enjoy it. Well, he's uh, he's out in the parking lot, kind of, kind of, kind of like on his own right now. I told you he was listening. Yeah. But uh, we're gonna yeah. we're gonna we're gonna try to drag him in here in a little while. All right, okay. check you later, Jeff. I told you he was listening. Uh, yeah. sure. Have a good night, buddy. So big goof. Oh, You're man. lucky they already picked the number one and number two entry in the rumble. Uh, but uh, I guarantee why, why why am I so lucky? Explain yourself. Because if you were number two and I was number one. Trust me, you'll be he, shit when I'm done with you. You oh said yeah? he was in number two. So well, two right. plus one is 21, and that was supposed to mean the end date for the world, but it'll be the end date for you, so you better watch oh, your wait, back. Wait a minute, hold on, hold on. I got a simple solution. You see, we're here right now, so why don't I just have him take your fat ass What's out right, right now? now? Right There'll, now. Be no There'll be no steel horsing. There'll be no steel no, horsing. You've sure, already sure. made me say I'll this four times. I know, right Vinny the smurf boy. 500 bucks. 500 bucks right now to kick his ass. If I recall correctly, didn't you say you were gonna you were gonna come here today and collect money from me that, that I'm supposedly supposed to owe you? Oh, yeah. Try to collect it with my bodyguard standing right behind me. How about that? Get over here. Come on. Come on. You all, right, all right, all right. All right, all right. All right, all right. Separate it out. Like who? Separate it out. This is a show. This is a radio show, not a wrestling ring, all right? Separate Definitely, it out. man. God dang. I'd say hug it out, but that would lead to too much violence. Especially in Vinny's but see, at least I know now I'm wearing dresses. that I'll be able to get my hands on the big goof, Bobby the Queer Dream, wherever the freak he went. He disappeared, And man. tough Jim Steele, the bitch Jim Steele, whatever you want to call him. And Octane the Waterhead. Octane the Waterhead. Yo, big goof, do me a favor, go out there, go get me a fucking Italian hero, and come back, okay? Yeah, fucking see, fucking that? All Bro right, man. You know what? I, think I ain't getting you do. nothing except an ambulance. Wow. How do you like that? Yo, let's do this right now, then. Hey, come let's on, let's go. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. No, 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 no. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. We're not. We're not going to have this right now. We're not. We're going to save We're gonna save it for the, for Snow Brawl. You know, cooler heads are going to prevail. All right, we're going to settle down. We're going to settle down a little bit. Definitely, man. You know, I think we should start throwing them all out and because these guys are getting too hot, man. Definitely. We, they definitely need to spend some yeah. time in the cold. Yeah. So, uh, let's, uh... You know, we're going to sit back. Who you know, called Jerry? Oh, shit, it's Nate, man. Uh-oh. You? you boys, uh, you're you done. <laughs> Who called Jerry? My name know, is you. the King Junior Reyes. You better well damn know it. The bitch Junior Reyes? Octane, 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 not here, not, 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 not. 
As soon as I walk in, I see an Oompa Loompa from the, from the Alpines. I don't even know where he came from. I see a bald-headed freak wearing a robe covered in cum. I don't even know what's going on here. All I know is that I was forced, forced to come to this show. Why? You're going to be forced at the door in a minute. Why? Because of my contract and probation. That's why. There's a conspiracy against the king, Junior Reyes, and I'm sick of it. March 23rd, yes, I'm facing Necro Butcher again. <laughs> Not gonna happen again. Sounds like you haven't been laid in a while. Here. I can't believe I'm actually agreeing with Octane on this one. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. The man, the man has to be here. Let him say what he's got to say. I dare any one of you in this room to go through what I went through and then ask for it again. There's something... We're s not stupid, so. <laughs> There's something that snapped in my brain and I'm not going to finish my career because Necro Butcher's not going to beat me. I'm not done yet. Somebody give him Ritalin. All right. Junior, Junior, how you doing tonight? I don't want to take your medication away, there, Ben. <laughs> don't worry about it. How I'm doing tonight? That, that's that's kind of what I asked, yeah. I'll tell you how I'm doing. I'm pretty pissed off that I have to sit in a room with a bunch of people I probably don't even know or ever heard of in my life because I was told to come here and just sponsor my match. I don't need sponsoring my match. All you need to know is there's going to be blood on the mat. There's going to be blood in the snow. There's going to be blood everywhere. So you're so you're uh, you're at, during Snow Brawl on March 23rd. You've chosen to wrestle Necro Butcher. Chosen. Yes. Chosen. I. Do you think, do you think that's a wise choice or what? I 